often coffee shops are sort of geared towards productivity and they might be very clean and white and stark and Rouge Roast just isn't that. It's colorful, it's vibrant, it's kind of chaotic, it's wacky. We want that to translate onto the website. We want customers to feel like when they visit the website, they're experiencing what they love most about Ruse Roast. Drinking it right now, lobster butter love right here. I don't know, this is not a lobster butter cup, but it's lobster butter, trust me. It, it really is, it is, yeah. Yeah, oh, hello, I'm John Roos, and this is Roos Roast. We're in the creative office that we call it, and we're gonna talk about School of Information. Hannah's over there, I'm not supposed to look over there though, so I won't, Hannah, hi. <laughs> I, I did, anyway, okay, yeah. When I originally started this business, it was just gonna be myself and a website and a roaster, and I was just gonna roast coffee and have a small business. But then it just grew really fast. It just kind of like left behind the website and just started doing coffee. But the website had, we realized like how much potential the website had during the pandemic. It really grew. The business of doing business is information nowadays. And so the challenge was is how do you take the information we're presenting and how do you make it better? And we were like wide open, like let, let's see what you do, you know? A lot of websites nowadays are very minimalist, very, very clean to a point where it almost feels kind of clinical. So I really liked the opportunity to work with Ruse and like they weren't like make our website look like this other website. Like they just said, make our website us. These sorts of projects need a lot of like back and forth, like collaboration, bouncing ideas off of each other. So I guess we started off with the competitive analysis and benchmarking, uh, just starting from the ground up and redesigning everything. I think for me, the two main pages that I was really dedicated to were the home page and the subscriptions page. I really wanted the home page to feel like as soon as you enter the site, you're entering the store. So I wanted to mimic a lot of that in-person feeling with fun graphics and sort of like digital printmaking and like adding a lot of photos to sort of give you the mm -hmm. feeling as if you're in like in the store meeting a barista. But a lot of our research showed and a lot of our benchmarking showed is that a lot of other coffee shops, their websites like would walk you through the subscription process and Ruse was missing that a little bit. So I tried to take an approach of like highlighting each step in the process, writing it out, adding icons and images to sort of help you. One of the big things that they talked about during our client visit was how they wanted to increase um, subscriptions but also wholesale partnerships. So that was one of the things that I was focusing on, especially within my competitive analysis review. It's best when you showcase what the partnership will look like, not only just like how to inquire and how to get in contact with them, but what exactly working with them would look like from a day to day. Ruse Roast is what it is because of the people and we wanted to highlight like not only John Ruse who created this all but his entire crew who like helps create such a great organization and, and business. Yes, we made a great beautiful project and we're really excited we got to do this for Ruse but I think it was really great personally and professionally for the both of us. Yeah, yeah. I think a new friendship has <laughs> yeah. formed so it's yeah. good. Yeah. <laughs> Bella and Emily's designs were really remarkable and stood out to us because they so clearly understood this idea of delightfulness, callbacks to the past, references to things that live in the Ruse Roast collective memory. Their website was super vibrant and really fun. We're probably going to see a lot better customer service, number one, through the website and also you know, a lot more clarity, less confusion, and possibly more orders, more, more business. You know, they really did the research to see what we, who we are, not just some, you know, like little, you know, cut and paste thing. It, it's actually, they were all pretty damn good. I mean, if we could just flip over to that right now, it'd be amazing. <laughs> <laughs>